What is going on YouTube? It's your boy EJ in the house. And today we're going to talk about the brim hat. The Y brim hat. Folks, if you're new around here, we talk about fashion, finances, books, and pretty much anything that is going to help you become a better you. So if you don't only want to look good, but feel good, consider hitting the subscribe button. Now back to the brim hat. In this video, I want to make it all about fashion. So I want to show you a couple different outfits that I love rocking with my wide brim hat. Folks, so hopefully I can give you some ideas on how to rock one of these brim hats. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into the outfits. Here we have outfit number one, which is the leather jacket. But before we put on the leather jacket, we're going to throw on a hoodie. The hoodie is going to keep you warm. It's going to have the hood coming off the back and then the leather is going to be your accent garment. Folks, you put on the brim hat and you throw on some shades. Now what I'm wearing here are these Ray-Ban shades that have a little bit of chrome to them, which perfectly match with the silver on the jacket itself. Let's not forget about the shoes. For this right here, we have tan Chelsea boots. They have some wear and tear, but it adds to the character of the outfit that I'm rocking. Next, we have this blue flannel, but this is not just your ordinary blue. This is more of a steel blue, sort of like an Air Force blue. Folks, you can never go wrong with a blue flannel. Keep in mind that I'm wearing the same pants these are black pants and a black shirt. So what's really making your outfit has to be the top piece. For this flannel, I switched up the shoes. To go with the Air Force Blue Steel, these boots show the stress. They've been around for a while. They've been around the block. Now let's go ahead and move on to the third outfit. Again, we throw a hoodie. Now we throw on the denim vest. Make sure the hood is not stuck on the inside. And now we're rocking a gray hoodie with a denim vest. So the top and the bottom of the outfit are polar opposites. On the top is a light tone. On the bottom is a dark tone with dark pants. And then we top it off with the brim hat. Now moving on to this other version of flannels. This used to be a regular flannel, I cut off the sleeves to have more of a 90s look. Again, we have the shades, we have the wide brim hat. Moving on, we have a blue bomber jacket. I think I got this at Sorrel a few years back, but this right here is a nice bomber and I don't even need the shades because the bomber itself is so sweet. We're going to switch off the shoes. These shoes are a little bit more clean. You can wear this out to a nice date. Next, we're gonna switch up the vibe. And this right here is more of a business casual look. As you can see, we have the concrete gray shirts in the bottom, and then we throw up a blazer on top, a nice pocket square, would have given this piece an accent color, but the brim hat is doing that as well in its own unique way because it is attention grabbing. This right here is not your traditional business look. The brim hat lets you know this is a creative industry. This could be for someone who works in entertainment, in music. Folks, this is a creative business casual look. Next we have all black. Folks, you can never go wrong with all black. On this shirt, I rolled up the sleeves just a little tiny bit to show some of those muscles that I am still working on, but I'll get there at some point in my life. Oh, 
Last but not least, this is more of a hipster look with a wide v-neck. Again, we have a concrete gray, but it has a graphic right in the center of it. And it looks like it's from the UK, from old America. It just gives it a vintage look. I switched up the pants. I have rips in the pants to go more with that vintage old look. Plus I brought back the de-stress boots, which adds a nice touch to the vintage outfit. And there you have it. Those are a few outfits I like to wear with my wide brim hat. If you have any outfits that you would like to share, let me know in the comments section below. We talk about fashion, finances, books, and pretty much anything that is going to help you become a better you. So if you don't only want to look good, but feel good, consider hitting the subscribe button.